Welcome back, everybody. We had a lot of crazy games this week, and we also had some top plays, so let's jump right into it. Coming in at number five, Central Punter gets a bad snap, but watch the grab, the one-handed grab, the boot, and watch where this one rolls to. Down inside the 10-yard line. That's a huge uh, turning point there in that game. Number four, Pocomoke at Snow Hill. The ball bounces off the post, and it bounces off a Snow Hill player, and he scores it for the wrong goal. That was for the 1A Regional Championship right there. Pocomoke wins. I hope we see the celebration. The celebration was the best part oh, of that yeah, entire I play. Oh, yeah, I did, too. That was beautiful. Number three, Parkside, Ken Island, regional title game. Shot, and Tyler Janeski with the save, diving to his right. Hey, he's a really good goalie for the Rams out there in uh, Salisbury. Number two, we're sticking with the Rams and Bucks. Reese Johnson, he's in the open field, and he fires a shot, and it goes in for the goals. Rams take down Ken Island, 2-1 to one for the regional title. And now, our top play comes out of Decatur. Bryson Coleman in the pocket, dropping back, lets it fly. Luke Murgott mm. dives and makes the grab in the corner of the wow. end zone. Uh, big play, Decatur goes on to win this one, and they will face North Carolina in the regional semis next week. Well, that's it for your top plays. We're talking about our Player of the Week nominees when we come back on DSI. Hi, my name is Marlon McDormand, and I'm with Pocomoke Field Hockey, and you are watching Delmarva Sports Insider.